Welcome back everybody to Blake Farm here on Farming Simulator 17. Today we are in field number one, spraying our soybeans. And I look like we got Mr. Yankee down there at the grass pasture. We're going to go see what he's doing here in a minute. Whoa. Wrong button. There we go. Uh, we got from here to shop over there, or the cow farm, I should say. Uh, this is the rig that you can't see it spraying, but it does. But it's got the add on. Of course, I didn't know how to do it, so uh, I downloaded the sprayer add on anyway. And you just click on it, and it works, folks. And uh, I have a control the uh it's the left control left all left space bar and x push the three down then push x it'll turn on the, the spot where the uh you know you control the spray button but i don't know which buttons control what after that so i'm still trying to figure that out but um big old pipe looks funny now I, I sprayed the corn right go I don't know why it didn't go all the way through I guess because the hired worker was doing it but I do have the crop destruction mod on but I got the tiny wheels so that's why it's not tearing it up see I got the little what do you think can I see it from here I zoom in You can see it's not spraying, but it is uh, taking care of it. But yeah, those are the tires. Actually running right down the middle. I like it. But I don't like my crops getting this big. As far as, uh, you know, planting and stuff. I like to do it before it comes up. Alright, I ain't worried about crossing the ends there. I just want to get this done. As much as possible, anyway. Now, um, I'm not probably going to stop this when I get to the end here and do this later. Because uh, I want to get the combine going show you all that and show you some of the animal stuff I bought. I bought quite a few things. Um, can't quite see it right there but I put some uh, straw, hay, grass, bale things down there and put some uh, sublish bales on the other side because we didn't have room. But uh, that might be changing pretty soon. Get locked back on here. See right here, I can turn off three quarters of this boom, a quarter of the boom. I just got to know the right button configurations. It'd help if they would have went ahead and put the the spray nozzles where it's spraying, so you tail. There you go, you can see straw, hay, I think grass, and then sewage is on around the barn there. This is where you can stack them. Kind of like a bale add-on thing. Alright, we're going to stop right here for a second. Alright, let's go take a look at our sheeps. Now this is the uh, storage space for the wool up to 110 pallets. I like it how it's got the empties right here. But yeah, and uh, a little lean tube here for the sheeps. And the water trough. The grass trough. And that's where you put the straw, which is anywhere right in here. 
Wait, wait, wait. You don't have straw for sheeps. No, just water and grass. I need to give them some grass. Uh, which ain't no problem. Got that done. Cows are good for right now. As you can see, I got 100 sheets. I did buy that many, folks. I, I really did. And, um, gotta buy some more cows, too. But we gotta get situated. I do want to put in a water trigger. I think we're gonna cut down a tree or two right here. Maybe three. Open this up. Four. We're gonna put a water thing right here. And that might be it. It's a water thing. We actually need a grass grass thing here somewhere to store grass bales. So we might put that in too. Alright, um I have no idea what this junk is right here. It'll be a good spot come in here, level all that out, clear the trees and put some honeybees things in here um let's see let's go on jump across walk through a bean field here show y'all this this pretty much is just to update what I spent the money on uh, remember I put in two million dollars yeah, there's the grass that would probably be yeah the hair straw there's the hay and there's the grass I need to get in here and clean these guys. They're getting dirty. Um, right here is the sillage. You notice how they was down flat on the ground? Well, you can come up right here and hit the left stick down and then pull a bell out. And you just go like that. Pull one bell out. Hit OK. Now pop it up right here. So I got the cheat mod on so I can lift. And you can just put it back in. Uh, I do want to cut this off. Uh oh, I'll say I got like every 20 minutes, but it seems like it does it sooner. Uh, I want to go straight out to the road here and put a mixing station and stuff like that in here. Um, I did find that this was under the ground along with that screen that was down here under the ground and GE mod uh, I did get two of the rollers um, I s so the tether and the wind roller to get bigger ones we'll fix and go look at that but I'll show you over here real quick uh, real quick we got straw water we just need food for them real quick we got 24 chickens um, so they're laying eggs right now. I need to let them to, uh, breed chickens. But I'm going to leave that alone for right now until we get, uh, stuff going. Uh, here's, I'll put the sign up right here. Here's where we can, uh, buy them straight out from here. Um, uh, dealership is way over where the wool is. I made a little road. I still don't know. Let's, let's do this real quick. It has a little small trigger right here. You can see the yellow door. Or yellow square around the door. I'm thinking that's going to be legit. I'm not for sure. But anything like that is supposed to be a trigger. And that's what it looks like. And I'll show you over here. You barely can see them, but you, you, can, you can see them right there. You can see the yellow boxes, outlines. Those are triggers. As long as you got that, you're good. Um, here's some equipment I ain't picked up yet. Uh, going to be for fuel and that. We got a truck and long gooseneck trailer. This is the one I want to show y'all. Um, and you can see Mr. Yankees down way back here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get this mower started real quick. Um, just hit B. And it starts going on its own. 
wish I could say the same about this. Now, I've been uh, doing this part here. My GPS is messed up for some reason. I don't know why it won't give me the lines. But you can see uh, he's making the bells back there. That's Mr. Yankee. And we got Ice Damon. If I'm saying that right, I hope I'm saying that right. Ice Damon. Damon. Um, the folks, all these names are uh, people that subscribe to me, watch my videos and stuff. So yeah, he's backing up over. Turn around. All right. I think he's going to come over this way and try to get some of this. Uh, I hope he does. But yeah, we got uh, a lot of... There's a contractor mod that holds up to eight workers. I've tried it, but it don't work good. You can't tab to the vehicles. You just tab to the people. So, uh, I don't quite like that, so I'm not going to use it. I might show it to you on uh, No Creek Farms, maybe, but. Alright, that's going to be that on that part. Um, go back to this guy. Uh, we got a load here. Uh, there's two, four, six, eight bales here. And I did buy the trailer skid steer along with this truck here. I thought this truck was crashing the game. Apparently I ain't. Had some difficulties, but everything worked out pretty good. Now it's not a lock and load trailer, so we have to be careful to skid steer. Oh yeah, he's getting over and getting all in that grass. Good. Um I don't have the helicopter no more. Like I said, I was gonna get rid of it. That's to just to show off map and stuff. And yes, folks, my videos are going to be, hang on a second, I got a uh, thing I got to take care of real quick, be right back. Alright, I am back, sorry about that. I'm running uh, Streamlabs OBS version 0.9.2. And it popped up a little red triangle saying, you know, I thought something was bad, but it's a notification, which it is bad. But, um, uh, what it was, I had 22% frame droppage. Uh, this is running better than the regular OBS. I need to get out of the ditch, get out of the ditch. Whew. Um, I'm running almost, almost 12, about 11 and a half actually. I'm sure, ain't no cars coming. This traffic is on. Oh, this truck's loaded. But, um, I'm running almost, it's like 38.8 CPU uh, frames anywhere from 6. To well, when I stopped this, then I had 20. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Easy, Mr. Blue. So I'm gonna need a. I don't need the big ones. Storage that is. So I'm gonna say, oh, they done got. What was they need? Okay, yeah, they do. Okay. Um, let's see, how can I do this? About right here. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Uh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, 
you have to back up to get it go down all the way. All right, let's get this baby off here. Mm, let's see here. Wish the mirrors actually worked. Whoa, 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 going backwards. All right. I got about 12 frames per second right now just doing this. But my audio is going to be messed up too because my regular uh, Logitech mic or whatever it's called, that cheap one. Um, easy now, Mr. Blue. Alright, I'm in. Raise up. Wasn't in all the way, but I got it off the truck. Without hurting the truck. Just let it down. Try to ram it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Oh, they're already making. Whoa. Look at there. I already got a pallet. I'm going to have to get a uh, pallet port for this thing, too. Oh, easy, easy. Oh, there I go up some more. Trying to do this in the first person is like really hard. But uh, I want to be like some of the other YouTubers. Not mention some names, but uh, I'd love to be up there where the squad's at. Maybe Brad M73. Brad M73 is the one that got me into this. Uh, I'm like, you know, he's just running his mouth, making video games. Or, or not making video games, but, you know, recording them. And people's liking it. I'm like, wow, why can't I do that? Let's see. They might take one more. They might take one more. I don't know. That means we're going to have to unstrap. Let's see. I'm going to take off the front right here. Get some weight off that tongue. But yeah, I, I thought, well, you know, I, I'll give it a try. Because my son bought this 50 cent video game that was Farming Simulator uh, 13. And then uh, I got hooked on 15. And I'm like, oh my God. I'm like, you know, got to have it. Let me hop out here and do these straps. Okay, just on those two. I'm going to try two at a time. It might do it. I don't think it will. Oh. What's... <gasps> no. Oh, I'm glad I got the capitation. Oh, I'm glad I got the capitation. Roll off of there, baby. There you go. All right, that should have done it, yeah. That's going to be good for right now, because we need to do some other things. Uh, it's already like 20 minutes in, so... Uh, Mr. Bell there, we, we, we're going to have a uh, spot for you. Okay, we're going to have a spot for you. I don't know where to put it. Like I said, I'm going to have to come in here and knock down these trees. I might put it right here. Let me show you what I'm talking about real quick. It's, oh, I hear a train in real life, folks. Grass right here. Y'all hear that? Yeah. See, this is what it is. It's just, let me spin it around. Like I said, you can come on this side right here and you can just throw your bales in there. You know, I think I got all of this. Or most of it. Yeah, I'm going to take that tree right there out and I'll put a 
couple of these down through here because we're going to need them for winter. And I think it'd be better instead of in here. I want to keep one or two of these trees, but I want to take four of them out, maybe that and there out, and put this down through here. Put a couple of them down through here. And maybe in a square one also. But uh, yeah. And that's going to be pretty much it for the sheets. Um. Okay. Okay. Cool. We'll get back to this later. We need to uh, perfecto. Um, like I said, my game crashed and I had to restart everything over. I had a bunch of stuff bought. I don't know which one, which made my game crash, but one of these mods did. So yeah, when we get done with the grass down there, we're going to have to come up here and wind roll this and bail it. Um, I got to get all the crops off before I can put crop destruction in. I already done across the ends here. I don't know if I told you, but right here is the end of the map. Um, some places go in different than others. Go to see right there, I can go way way out here and uh yeah so it all depends I say I can't get back in now <laughs> yeah I gotta do that um, and this is uh, the other uh, tractors I bought the uh, 8030 which I think it's a uh, bigger than that now uh, 8530 that's what it is yeah 8530 uh, I wanted a big John Deere tractor for like the mower uh, be able to attach stuff on the front and back and be able to have enough power to run it I can't use this auger wagon with that combine out there and you see those tracks right there that's where I sprayed I sprayed that right there and that's what done that but anyway we got the combine the corn header and the grain header and the buggy all these go together that'll be what we use on the corn um this little guy here the little combine see hung yeah i'm gonna have to cut another round so you can't back up against the wall I'll do a little back here at Matt. We're getting close to the time. Let's see, let's see if we'll make another round, of course. We'll get them here in a minute. Um, we're going to unload what he's got into these buggies. And then we got to take this to the chickens and to the, uh, uh, the seed masters. Which I'm going to show you that here in a minute. Um, I got two of these trucks. Uh, it's got a, a, a bleh, grain tipper trailer on it. But I've been using the skid steer to get the bales, bringing them over here. Uh, I do have the auto load turn on. You know, it's kind of realistic. We go get them. So we might do that on the next episode. But here's this guy, our second truck. Here's a shop. I've redone a lot of stuff up here. This was all gravel. I turned it to uh, concrete, I believe. Yeah. Uh, a little bit around the thing here. Oops, I missed a little grass right there. Um, to open this up, I think I told you the last time the door won't open all the way. It, it's as far as it open right there. Well, I had to come back in here and repaint the ground because I got... Uh, was taking the grass out around the shed there and I end up getting uh, gravel in here instead of concrete so yeah but the big shed down here only thing that gets me is every time we restart the map 
See, that door is supposed to go all the way over there. If anybody knows anything about it, let me know. Uh, fertilizer seeds might be reversed, but the fuel tank was way over there by the road, by the light pole. So I went and GE moved it over here. All the triggers still work. Um, I think I put this in on last time. I'm not for sure. Shows what's in the grain tanks. Moved that building around a little bit. Scooted the propane tank back and added another one just for looks. And this is our tablet. Open the door here. Um, this is our tablet charging station and uh, Q puts a tablet in, takes it out. I really don't know uh, if it will work on this map, but I took some extra grass out over here and put a gravel in, just made this area wider uh, so we can park equipment down through here. Um, I can't remember if I up these things or not. They ten thousand each. I think I made them to twenty thousand. I'm not for sure. I don't know if it'll tell me or not. No, don't tell me offhand. But uh, we're gonna bring liquid fertilizer to these two and fill them up with seeds, with grain, and they'll make seeds for us. And I want to put a uh, some kind of silo here somewhere. And I also got a couple of these uh, tires that's making us eighty dollars an hour. Uh, kind of helps out a little bit. This one point one million dollars I got is going to go pretty fast, folks. Um, let's see here. Yeah, let's go back this way. Now he's blocked again. I'm gonna go ahead and take care. Oh, don't hire a worker yet. I'll make another loop on this end. I'll tell you what, I'm just gonna get this guy going in circles. I should do it. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, he missed. Yes. Alright, hang on. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. That should be doing right. And also on this course play, I got cow farm, north farm, transport. And I got uh, some routes on there. So, uh, yeah. Anything to market. Uh, I mean, market to any farm will be in transport. Anything leaving North Farm will be in here. Whoa, what are you doing, mister? You can't back up in the crops. I'm just going to have to get them to go around these, these light poles, throwing them off too. But um, trying to think of some other things, folks. Uh, I don't want to go too big. Like I said, I don't want to go too big. But we do need equipment to do things with. Um, like I, I got this bigger, you know, like the mower, and I got what a total of three big tractors. Kind of doing smaller things. I need to get the mower back running. Mr. Yankee sitting there in the air, chilling. He's a good guy. Um, surprised I ain't seen Colin Jr. around. Whoa! I started it, but I forgot to put it down. Alright, I'll move down through here. Pretty nice tractor. Good and bunch of power. I, I love the Ford New Holland or just New Holland, whatever they call now. 
Yeah, that tree right there needs to come down. But it's going to, like I said, that grass right there, I wish we could mow it. It won't let us touch that kind. saying but a lot but trying to make sure I cover everything that I've done so it won't be too big of a surprise but I, sh I think our sheep's going to be all right we just need to get more cows uh, we need to get the poop going uh, really need to get it going because we can do we got those two little small things we can do the smaller fields with and then uh, don't have to worry about buying so much fertilize um, also when we get up a little bit further ahead get more cows there's a liquid digestate station that takes the cow slurry and turn it into fuel and liquid fertilizer I think dry fertilizer too, I'm not for sure. I know it does a couple of things. Now, right, worker's taking over now. I hope he goes. Uh, who we got? Oh, we got Junior on the track. Alright, Junior, way to go. I'm gonna pop on over. We got a look like Colin Julian on the combine. Yep. So there we go, folks. Colin Julian up there, Mr. Yankee, Junior. Um, we do have lots of other people. I uh, wonder how full he was. I can also go my glance mod, if y'all can see it right there. Get it in the grass. Uh, top left. Uh, Balin is blocked, of course. And uh, we got wheat harvesting and we got New Holland T8 mowing so that's three of probably good 30 workers we can do um, and here we got the small corn head I don't think we're going to use it we'll probably take the rest of this money and buy another combine like this this is 9610 we'll probably run two of these but we got a lot of corn to get off the fields. Um, 100 sheep, 15 cows. I'm going to up that cow to at least 50, maybe. And oh, yeah, I forgot. We got, we got, let's go ahead and repay this real quick. There, we got $1,089,464 left. A zero loan. Oh, when I hit back for it. Um, and of course we don't have no crops um, grass go to growth as you can see we got a little bit here left uh, we got three and six is wheat two and five is corn one is soybeans I'm thinking about buying ten but I'm not for sure. What is on? 10 is what? Canola? Yep. And it is growing. 7 is a grass field. Which we really need grass. Let's see. Let's just visit field seven. See how much it is. A hundred and twelve thousand. That's not bad. And we can go ahead and harvest this off of here. And give it to our cause our cows and sheep's gonna need it. Let me just zip my speed up here a little bit. And uh oh. Turn red on me up there. There we go. 22. 
you know what, folks, I, I think we're going to go ahead and do that. What do y'all think? We need some more uh, fields. Might well go ahead and buy them where we got the money, right? Oh, don't do that. Well, let's buy this field here. Hang on a second. Let me look at the map real quick. We buy 10. We'll, uh, we might buy 10, 11, and 7. How's that? Something like that. Let's, let's go ahead and buy this one. Okay, walk away and do it again. Ah, buy. That one's ours. Let's go back down here and buy this grass field. Right, wait, let's go over. I think this one's a grass field. Oh, Colin Julian's flashing. That means he is. Oh, don't tell me. Can I raise up a little bit? Is this a, a tiny patch of grass? Oh. I tell you what, we'll, we'll get it. And, um. Because we got canola. And uh, we'll have three grass fields. So, yeah. We'll get seven. I think. Not bad. 44,000. Okay. We got 10 and 11. And I don't know why I'm running for. Go visit real quick. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, then uh, ten, eleven. Uh, we can get seven. Let's go ahead and get seven, folks. What do y'all think? See, it looks like that's part of our field, but we can't touch that right there. All the way across, we can't touch. Uh, let's get seven. We can always turn it in something else later. All right, we're down to 709,000. I got to save rest of that because we got to get us a uh, another combine. There we go. That's what I need to be in. All right, folks, we're going to go empty out Colin real quick. And then, uh, where's he at? We'll go this way. And on our next episode, we'll uh, come down here, pick up the straw. I'm going to finish mowing that field that we're in down there, field four. But yeah, I can't use that uh, other auger because this pipe is too low to the ground. It'll go over the buggy, but it's not tall enough to unload in, so. There we go. Well, folks, I hope y'all enjoyed this and uh, got off the tractor. There we go. There we go. That's beautiful right there. I need to take it screenshot of that. Huh. Oh, hope it took. There it goes. There it goes. It took. Oh, that was stop watch. Screenshot saved. There we go. Yeah, I installed a, a stopwatch so I know how long I've been recording because on Streamlab OBS it doesn't have a timer on it yet. I hope they, uh, put that in pretty quick but this seems like it's doing pretty good to me and I hope it is doing good to y'all uh, just let YouTube process it this right and hopefully and maybe oh I gotta get out of Collins way oh I'm not even having this track hang on Colin hang on I'm moving oh man really Well, it don't look like he damaged them. Maybe the hard workers don't. 
I'm not crossing this ditch. I crossed it once before and got stuck. And it's pretty deep in places. Let's see what he does with the telephone pole. I bet you he'll go up to it and stop. Yep. Alright, folks. I want to finish this up. Finish the grass for it up. And uh, I will see y'all in the next episode. Alright? Love each and every one of y'all. Uh, close. There we go. I love each and every one of y'all. And I hope y'all have a great day. A blessed day. Thank you for watching. And I will see y'all later, folks.